Oh, good luck there in the Mara. Brenton, we've had such a wonderful, wonderful elephant sighting. It's been very difficult to leave them because there's so much interaction constantly going on. Some pushing one another around. Let's see what happens with these two. <laughs> Look at that. Okay, drinking some of the water out of this dry riverbed that they found. Look at that little one on the right hand side. You can see how small it is. So cute. <laughs> Rolling around and playing. Oh, it is amazing. Isn't that just too precious? <laughs> Don't tell anybody I said that. It's meant to be a rugged game range. I'm not allowed to say something's precious. <laughs> <laughs> don't tell James, actually. Everyone else is fine. Just don't tell James. <laughs> James, I think, is on holiday at the moment. Again. <laughs> you can see how that one splashed water all over itself. So, Edith, these elephants can probably smell the water. Their sense of smell is incredible and they can often smell water, especially ground water, so they know where to dig and, and to find it. Um, also, just a few scrapes of the foot and they get quite deep and then they'll, um, they'll quickly s see or soon find if there is water around. It's mostly through, through sense of smell, Edith. Oh, look at this one on the bank, just off to the right. Oh, let's just see, splash water all over his head. <laughs> look at that. And oh, they're breaking branches and they oh, There's so much going on there. Look at that one coming down the little bank there now. <laughs> uh, Stevie, you said, oh, this is so cute. <laughs> this is indeed. These little ones, they are very cute. But look at that Looks water like all over the head, forehead. Same hairstyle as Michael Jackson. <laughs> Fergus is the same hairstyle as Michael Jackson. Uh, Fergus. <laughs> Oh, look at this little one. <laughs> trying to dig for some reason. It doesn't get much better than this. This has really been such a wonderful sighting. Rishi, the age that elephants start developing tusks can can vary quite a bit, but I've seen young elephants uh, about, I'd say probably on average three to four years, some a little bit younger, but three to four years you'll start seeing those tusks protruding out of the mouth already. So from that age you'll definitely start seeing those little tusks. Um, but like I said, it can vary sometimes. Sometimes um, elephants develop late um, and sometimes maybe a little bit earlier. You'll see these little tusks coming through. Yeah, they're all moving off slowly. There's still one or two stragglers here. See the nails quite clearly on the feet of the elephant there too. Oh, 
Shava, you asked if the elephant have ear holes like other animals. They do indeed. I'm trying to see if we can maybe zoom in on this one. You can. There's the ear hole. Can you see that? There we go. You can see the ear hole in the front of the ear. There it is. They do indeed have ear holes. All the better to hear you with. <laughs> Jamie, the elephants do indeed um, feed on soil from time to time when they're looking for salts or certain minerals from the, the sand or the soil or the clay. In this particular situation, they're not. They, they purely have dug here full of water. I've been watching them to see if they have been, but, um, but from what I've seen, it's purely full of water that they've been drinking out. However, there's probably a lot of minerals in this water because it has been drained through the and through the sand and the clay so there's probably some minerals that have been washed through into the water but this particular sighting they've purely been trying to drink the water that they've that they've dug for i haven't seen them actually feeding on the soil or on the sand or clay but they will do that from time to time especially in certain areas where there's not a lot of food or vegetation around and they need nutrients but the bush is still looking really wonderful here. Still a lot of greenery around, even some of the grass is still quite green. So that's obviously due to the late rains that we had. So the wonderful time of year this. And because of those late rains, still a lot of food around for all these animals, especially the big elephant. Oh, I can feel the temperature starting to drop now. All right, well, I think we're going to leave these elephants now. What a wonderful sighting. <laughs> Tristan is still out, and 